Education, um, but I rise to speak as a Green Party member. I think the failure to agree the ESA bill was, was, was very much a, a failure of the executive. But now the Assembly is asked, being asked to to connect to that failure by passing this through accelerated passage, and that's something that I, I cannot support. It's I think it's important that we get this bill right rather than get it quickly. Um, I think it's important that uh, members have the time to, to consider potential amendments, um, to consider what has been lost from the, the, the ESA bill and, and what could perhaps further could be, be salvaged. I understand there's a concern about the footing of the current education and library boards, and whilst I am as, as keen as anyone else in this House to um, see a long-term solution, um, whatever it might look like, to give certainty to the education sector. Um, a, 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 a rushed bill will only ever be a stopgap stop gap and will not provide that certainty. So I am not sure that this, this bill and passing it through accelerated passage would serve the purpose um, that it purports to. Um, it would very much appear that this slimmed down bill is, is what can and has been agreed between the DUP and Sinn Féin, but it is not what has been agreed um, in negotiation with this Assembly. I think it is right that such an important bill should go through the uh, full processes. Um, and the, the Chair of the Committee referred to this as an 11th hour solution. Um, I think it's too important uh, an issue um, to be to be taken forward in this manner, and for that reason, I oppose accelerated passage. Call Mr.